is going to be a lot trickier because now you've got the captain to deal with. Let's see what's added with version 1.01, so... I wouldn't recommend taking him on, though. It's better just to leave him alone. Oh, I guess you do tap the punch to run You better, right? The only time it might be a problem is when you have to get the, the doors downstairs, but... If you get lucky and find all the key cards, it shouldn't be much of a problem. I'd recommend opening up the... Probably the infirmary just in case, but it all depends on if you can find enough key cards to do it. Now these two I'm gonna put behind that counter because I've always found that they, they don't get released if they're behind the counter, so if I need these for an emergency, I'll have them back here. Uh, of course they don't cooperate with me. Come on. My only two chances to rescue them if I have to. a little extra time but it's worth it just in case oh you gotta watch out though because the NPCs will accidentally shoot civilians if you're not careful I've seen it happen that was moving a civilian and they shot him dead and I was just like what the fuck happened there <laughs> it's kind of funny really all right there we go Get those guys there so that just in case there's the key card I'm gonna actually use these for the objectives just to make it easier. If they're downstairs, then I'll use them. If they're upstairs, I won't use them. Ooh, and I got the box in a good spot too. I can just camp behind this desk here and I don't have to worry about a damn thing. Exactly how my uh, my first son. Uh, I actually got the trophy. I think it was the exact same spawn. I just camped behind this desk the whole time, and I had, I think I had chains. I can't remember who else I had with me, but I remember having chains. I just camped right here, and I was fine. They protect protected me the whole time. Of course, I was using Rogue at the time, since muscle wasn't a thing. Oh boy, I don't want to mess with him. If I just waited long enough, let's hope the assault will end and uh, he'll leave. Yeah, that or I'll let Wolf and Soka handle him. Best not to challenge the dozers because they're dangerous. Plus, it's a lot of ammo that goes to waste, so it's better just to ignore them if you can. Hang on, I'm gonna get rid of that shield there if I can. There we go. Oh, I had a chance, I missed it. I need him to... There! Yes, he'll leave. See? I didn't have to face that dozer. I just avoided him and the assault ended, so now he's gonna leave on his own. Yeah, look at him. Walking away. So much easier than having to actually shoot him and waste all my ammo on him.
especially since my uh, golden AK has so little ammo as it is, even if it is pretty powerful. I'd still rather save for an emergency if I have to fight a dozer. There's a chance for a keycard to spawn on one of the desks here, but I don't have time to check for it. Gotta get this open as quickly as possible, and then I'll see if it's here or not. But I'm gonna save this keycard, rather than not use it unwisely. It is a good idea to hide in this room, because the doors are pretty much blocked off. There's only one door for them to come in, so it's a good spot to hide. Whoa, oh crap, I just got cloaked. <gasps> Hello. Wolf, so call. One of you, please get me up. <gasps> uh oh, no, no, no. Oh shit. Hurry up, so call. Hurry the fuck up. Hurry up. Alright, let's get Wolf off quickly. Little too close there. Oh, good job, Soko. Just ignore that message in the corner. <laughs> I should have turned notifications off, but it's alright. Kind of bombed my video a bit there, but it's alright. Not his fault. He didn't know. Good job, Soko. So proud of you. Good team. Good teamwork, guys. Let's hope I get lucky and get it on the first try. Thankfully, cloakers don't count torture down, so if you get cloaked, don't worry about it. Damn. Oh. Alright, salt over. I barely had to shoot any cops at all. This one might have to be a two part because it's already going on like 10 minutes already. We'll see. Ah, very nice on the second get, on the second try. Not bad at all. That worked out well. Oh, and I forgot to check around this room. There can be a key card on, on the desks or on the copy machine or on those machines up there. I'm not sure what those machines are. Sometimes you'll get a key card like on the desks here with the oh, see? I got a key card right there. So very important though is you'll want to save one of those for the exit because you're gonna need it to open the exit door, so that's why I'm using them very sparingly. I should be paying attention to that, because I'm distracted. <laughs> but yeah, you definitely wanna save one for the exit and don't waste one on the infirmary unless you really need it. If you're like, you've been down twice by the cops, go ahead and open the infirmary because it's better not to risk it. You don't want to be leave, like seeing gray and then have to rush to the infirmary because there's a good chance they're going to kill you and you end up going to custody. So don't wait till that they're down.
if you can, try to shoot them in the head too. It'll save you some ammo. Headshots do more damage. A little bit. It's hard to do when they're like about to touch the thing. Don't let them touch that because it makes it take even longer. So just go over body shots, kill them as quickly as you, if, as you can. But if you got a guy across the room, he's not moving, just go ahead and shoot him in the head if you can to save you some ammo. That's if you really need, to, if you really feel like killing them, but mostly just let the NPCs do the work for you. Because they've got infinite ammo, so. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> They're not gonna run out of ammo. I think about halfway, like uh, around this, when you do the second objective, that's when the captain shows up. Just, I think you should probably just ignore him. I'm not gonna try killing him, it's just too risky. Uh, oh, good, I got an easy one for the second one. I'm only gonna need two key cards. Beautiful, I'm getting all this upstairs stuff too. Oh, look at that, another key card. Lucky me. Not that I really need it. I'm doing just fine. But yeah, when the captain shows up, I'm just gonna completely ignore him because he's not much of a danger until I actually need to leave. Unless I need to go downstairs, but that's when I'm gonna use a key card so that I don't have to stay down there too long. Time comes when I have to get the uh, the, what you, the server. I'm gonna put my armor bag on because I know I'm gonna be slow anyway, so I might as well have that extra protection on the way out. And I'm just gonna try and run past the captain. If I go down, hopefully Wolf or Sokol can get me back up. You should never need the armor, especially if you just let the NPCs do most of the killing because there'll be plenty of ammo for you to pick up since they're killing all the enemies. Alright, I'm just gonna stop this here because I'm about to, like, 50 minute limit. I'm getting pretty close. And then I'll continue with the next one. <laughs> 